Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Undertale. So last time we left off, we were about to face Undyne. But you know what? Let's give it to her. Let's hit her up with the boppin'. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come! Unguard. Undyne attacks. Plead with it. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. This is it. You got an interesting new spear blocking mechanic. Undyne draws her finger across her neck. You told Undyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Not bad. Then how about this? I know they get really tricky. Guaranteed. Undyne's suplex is a huge boulder, just because she can. For years, we've dreamed of a happy ending. Undyne found sensation, and I know that <laughs> when I eventually go through genocide mode, this is probably going to be my like, least favorite fight in the game. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. I won't let you snatch it away from us! Smells like sushi. Okay. Nyeh! Enough warming up! Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, that was close. Undyne suplex is a huge boulder, just because she can. Mercy! Ha! I still can't believe you want to. Spare me. Okay. You know what? We're green. I'm out of here. Leave me alone. Okay, you hear the footsteps. I'm alone. You won't get away from me this time. Undying attack. Honestly, I'm doing you a favor. As long as I'm green, I can't hit the flea button. Dying points heroic towards the sky. My spear is the spear that will pierce the heavens! <laughs> no human have ever made it past Asgore. Um, um rule breaking. I'm dying because of our friends. And killing you is now an act of mercy. Whoa, 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 whoa. chill, chill, chill! And Dying flashes a menacing smile. So stop being so damn resilient! Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Ah. 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 Ooh. Ooh. Not today. Gone. Yeah. Can you not? Please. You escaped from me for the last time. And dying attacks. Alphys told me humans were determined. And I'm determined to leave, boy. Whoa, 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 wait, whoa. Undyne Tower's threat. Take an ice cream. An illustration of a hug. Your HP was maxed out. I see now what she means by that. Hey. Hey. Undyne points the rope until you start. But I'm determined to. Oh God. Yeah. I got him. Oh, oh. Okay. Undyne flashes a menacing smile. There. Determined to end this right now! Ow. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her She is the epitome of an anime creature. Right now! End it then? Undyne suplex is a huge boulder just because she can. Nah, die already, you little brat! Oh, 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 stop! 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 Eh. Gone. 
Leave me alone. Drink. Papyrus, not the time. You, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. I'm trying not to die, Papyrus. Let me out, let me out, let me out. No! Stop running away. She didn't make me green. Yes. Sand, you butt! Jesus. Jesus. Armor. So hot. But I can't give up. There. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water. Yes. You take a cup of water. Here. Want to die in the water? Yes. Here, fish lady. Drink. Drink with your face. And she's gone. Oh, yes, thank you. The water cooler. Take a cup of water. Yes. Wish to drink the cup of water. The water evaporated from the heat. The cup evaporated too. Jesus. Being such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. Sorry, sorry. Laboratory. <laughs> Where's Dexter? That thing has to say Dexter on it somewhere. Alright, let, let's go back this way. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, that's creepy. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. You? A cup of water? Are you just carrying that around to look sophisticated? Because it's not working. I thought it could give you water. I guess not. A cup of water returned to the water cooler. What? Now Sans is gone. Okay. So here's the cool thing. We're done with Undyne. Thank God. But. 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 I do not wish to go through the game twice over just to get through the through the, 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 the true pacifist ending. I want to just go for the passive sending straight from the get-go. Bah! Today's monsters don't appreciate what makes it look great. Nowadays, puzzles are nothing but lasers and moving rocks. Bah! There's no art in that action-y, mindless look. It's just timing-based drivel. Give me something that challenges the deepest reaches of my mind. You! You're young. You've still got hope. <laughs> Here, try solving this block-pushing puzzle. No. Good. I'm very good, thanks. I'm pretty sure that puzzle actually has no ending. But yeah, so since I want to go for what I what is known as the true pacifist ending, you have to befriend everyone. And there are a few people you can end up missing if you're not paying attention. One of them being Undying. And another one being a character we have yet to meet yet, so I won't spoil who that is. Mmm, no. There we go. Yeah. Get me out of here. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. thing is, I don't remember where the house is that I'm looking for. I think it's this way. Is it this way? I want to say it's this way. It's a rubber ducky. Yes, this is it. What? 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 It's a living. A living. Oh, they're saying that their job is a living. 
Okay, I'm an, I'm an idiot. Oh, oh, the human arrives. Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you two great friends. Will you hang out? Yes. Okay, stand behind me. Make sure to give her this. She loves these. Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? You bet I am. And I brought a friend. Hi, I don't think we've... Why don't you two come in? Here, Undyne. My friend brought a gift for you. On their own. Uh, thanks. I'll, uh, put it in with the others. <clears throat> so, are we ready to st uh, Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wrong person. So, are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie. I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. You two have fun. G good job, Papyrus. So why are you here? To rub your victory in my face? To humiliate me even further? Is that it? No. Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think I'm gonna be friends with you, huh? Right? Yeah. Really? Oh, how delightful, I accept. Let's all go frolic in the fields of friendship. Not. Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. Dang, what a shame. I thought Undyne could be friends with you. But I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? What? Papyrus, wait a second. Darn it. He thinks I can't be friends with you. <laughs> what a joke. I can make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be... Besties. I'll make you like me so much, you won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> it's the perfect revenge. Why don't you have a seat? Sit down and progress? Yes. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. All set. What would you like? Huh. Hey, don't get up. You're the guest. Sit down and enjoy yourself. Um, why don't you just point to what you want? You can use the spear. What if I point at you? Are you hitting on me? <laughs> Let's see. Sugar. Frozen tea. Soda. Sickly yellow liquid. Hot chocolate. Green cylinder. Yikes. Tea box. Blatantly correct choice. Hmm. Let's go with the tea. Tea, huh? Coming right up. Uh, I just ain't a fan of chocolate, so... It'll take a moment for the water to boil. Okay, it's all done. Here we are. Careful, it's hot. Uh, th thank you. Can I, can I drink it? It's not that hot. Just drink it already. You take a sip of the tea. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious friend. Hey. You know, it's kind of strange that you chose that tea. Golden flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. <laughs> You're both total weenies. Sort of. You know, 
I was a pretty hot-headed kid. Once, to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad. But he was beaming. I had never seen someone so more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight. Like a uh, papyrus. But, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the Royal Guard. Don't tell him I said that. He's just, well, I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's, he's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up being friends with you instead. I can never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into little smiling shreds. That's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know. So, um, maybe he could do something else with his life. Oh, sorry, I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Wait a second. Papyrus, his cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now! And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to take it for him! right! Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking! Which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine! <laughs> Afraid? We're gonna be best friends! Get over here! Let's start with the sauce! Whoa! Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy! Now, pound them to dust with your fist! How will you pound? Strong! You punch the vegetables at full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah! Yeah! Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients. Now it's my turn! No! Jesus Christ, Undyne! Uh, we'll just scrape this into a bowl later. But for now... We add the noodles. Homemade noodles are the best. But I just buy store brand! They're the cheapest! Yeah. Nah, just put them in the pot. How will you put them in the pot? Fiercely. You throw everything into the pot as hard as you can, including the box. It clanks against the empty pot. Yeah! I'm into it! Alright, now it's time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it! Whoa! Stir harder! I'm button mashing as fast as I can harder! Ugh, let me do it! Okay, you're stabbing it! You're stabbing the pasta, that's not stirring! <laughs> that's the stuff! Alright, now for this final step. Turn up the heat! Let the stovetop symbolize your passion! Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire! Ready! Don't hold anything back! Alright, let's hold right. Let's go! Hotter? Hotter! Undyne? Hotter, darn it! Undyne! Hotter! Wait, that's too- <laughs> Hmm. Ah. Man, no wonder Papyrus sucks at cooking. So, what's next? Scrapbooking? Friendship bracelets? Oh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me. We can't be friends. That's okay. Because, if we're not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret! I've been defeated. My house is in shambles. 
I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch, all out on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now come on, hit me with all you've got. Undyne is letting me make the first attack. Nope. Show me what you've got. Nope. Do your worst. Nope. What's the matter, scared? Nope. What the hell is the hold up? No. Nope. Come on already. No. It's getting hot in here. Alright, I guess it's fair Fight. Molly up. One damage. What? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking at full force. You just can't muster any intent to hurt me, huh? Huh. <laughs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated your stupid... saccharine stick. I, I guess that's how you say that? Uh, hey, wait, wait. Saccharin. Saccharin. Okay. At first, I hated your stupid saccharin shtick. But the way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you aren't just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human. It seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight. But knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here. And I'll take their soul instead. That makes sense, right? Oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the hell out of you. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> now, let's get the hell out of this flaming house. Love how the house is crying. Well, that was fun, huh? We'll have to hang out again another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang out with Papyrus. So if you need me, drop by Snowden, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give Papyrus a ring, okay? Since we're in the same spot, I'll be able to talk too. Well, see you later, punk. This poor house. Just on fire now. It's a living. Alright, well, I'm going to leave this episode of Undertale off here. We beat Undyne. Well, I say beat. We didn't really fight her. But yeah, I'll leave it off here for now. We finished the Undyne fight. I'll walk my happy butt all the way back over to Hotland. And, you know, we did the, the mini game with uh, Undyne. Now we made friends with her. Friends with Papyrus. We're friends with, by extension, Sans. Friends with Undyne. There are now, I think two characters left that we need to befriend before the actual game is over. Maybe technically one. I don't remember how that works. Let me just reset that. But yeah, if you liked today's episode of Undertale, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. If you aren't already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Join the Curly Crew. That way you always know whenever I drop a brand new episode. Also, if you haven't already done so and you are a part of the Curly Crew, hit that notification bell. That way, whenever I drop a new episode, you get notified. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play Undertale, where we go through Hotland and see what's going on over there. And, I, ooh, actually, we're coming up on one of my favorite bosses. Uh, she actually resides in Hotland, and it is only because of her music is she a fantastic boss. I love that fight. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful... Listen here, you grumpy Goomba. I'm not touching your puzzle. Day!